What's up guys, welcome to this video and in this video I'm going to show you how you can fix if your photos are not saving to your camera roll after creating a picture through your camera or any other way you get your photos. So if your photos are not saving to your camera roll, first of all, it I know it's really easy, but just try to restart your phone. What you want to do is hold the power button and hold a power and hold the volume up button at the same time. And once you did, just click on slide to power off. So slide to power off, wait a few seconds. And once you did, hold the power button in again and your phone will be restarted. And sometimes this is the easiest way to fix any problems on your iPhone. If you already tried this and it's still not working, you want to try a second method. What you want to do is you want to go to settings and you want to go to general and click on iPhone storage. And what you want to see is if your storage is completely full, it will say 512 of the 512 gigabytes used or however, however much storage you have on your phone. So make sure you have enough storage on your phone to even store an, another photo. So let's say mine said 512 gigabytes of the 512 gigabytes used. You won't be able to store any other photos and that's probably why your photos are not being stored. So make sure to have enough gigabytes. Make sure to save at least one to two gigabytes on your phone. Once you did and it's still not working, you want to try the third method. And that's really, it's not a nice step to do, but if it's still not working, try and erase your phone. So you can do this by going into general, going into transfer or reset your phone. Be cautious with this because this will reset your entire phone as if it's completely new. So make sure you have a backup of your, enti of your entire phone. You can backup your phone by clicking on iCloud and clicking on iCloud backups and automatically back up your iPhone if in case you lose it. So make sure to always have a backup on your iPhone if you want to try this method. But it should work and it will give your phone a complete reset. So this one should work. I know it's not the not a, not a best way to do it and you maybe don't want to use this method, but otherwise you have to go to an Apple store and they will probably tell you the same. So I hope you learned something from this video. If you did, make sure to like and subscribe. And that's basically it.